Good day everyone, my name is Pauline Borja Miranda, taking up Bachelor of Secondary Education major in English. And now, I'm here to present how to navigate SoundCloud as part of the teaching learning process. Online streaming services aren't new. There are innumerable ways to stream audio and music online. But SoundCloud has some advantages over the competition. SoundCloud is a free-to-use website for uploading audio. All you need to start is your email address or the usual Facebook or Google sign-in information. If you were just using SoundCloud to listen to music and maybe upload some amateur things for your friends, then Facebook or Google emails could be the way to go. By allowing sound files to be embedded anywhere, SoundCloud can be combined with Twitter and Facebook to let members reach their audience better. By simply checking or clicking a share button designated to the site you wish to host a share and approving the post, audiences on the site can see the content through their desired media outlet. Registered SoundCloud users have the power to listen to as much content as they wish and upload up to 180 minutes of audio through their profile. All of these features are free of charge and are available to all SoundCloud users as soon as they have a registered profile with the site. SoundCloud distributes music using widgets and apps. Users can place the widget on their own websites or blogs, and then SoundCloud will automatically tweet every track uploaded. SoundCloud has an API or application programming interface that allows other applications or, or smartphones to upload or download music and sound files. SoundCloud also provides users with the ability to create and join groups that provide a common space for contact to be collected and shared. SoundCloud can also serve as an instructional material wherein, in such speech classes, teachers can just record, upload, and share the files to the students. Also, in developing listening skills of the students, SoundCloud is one way of facilitating it. But how do we use SoundCloud? If you don't have SoundCloud account, we still need to sign up first. Signing up for a SoundCloud account allows you to take full advantage of all of SoundCloud's features, including customization and personalized statistics. You can sign up through your Facebook or Google account or just use your email address Simply click on the uh, sign up button on the home page. And we can actually make use of our sign in information with Facebook. Alright, so if you're already signed up, we need to set up your profile. So we need to click on the profile icon in the top navigation bar. And then click edit. You can add links to your website, Facebook, Twitter, last.fm, songkick. Tumblr and more, and SoundCloud will directly link to them on your profile. Once your profile is all set, upload your songs or audio files by clicking Upload next to your avatar in the tap navigation bar. With a free account, you can upload up to 120 minutes worth of sounds. There you go. You're all set for your SoundCloud profile. I just demonstrated the important and basic steps of SoundCloud. To know more about it, better explore or navigate the application by yourself. So there you have it. Thank you for watching.